Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. So I think I'm in love with the dollar store. <laughs> Today I went to the dollar store to buy some batteries for remote control and I ended up buying another um, petite block set as I said I would in my other video. <laughs> um, yeah, I really like the Panda, so I thought, why not add a lion to the set? You know, it was only 100 yen, so whatever, not that big of a deal. And plus, I really like building little stuff, so I thought, you know what, let's give it a try again and try out the time-lapse function again on my camera. And yeah, so why not? So let's go ahead and build this and see what it looks like when it's finished. Alright, and there we go. The lion is finished. Now, <laughs> it's pretty cute. I like it. It kind of resembles a, a lion. Uh, the quality of the blocks is, you know, not much to uh, talk about, but it was only a dollar, so I can't really complain. Um, it does have a movable mouth, which is pretty cool. That's interesting. And the tail is kind of poseable, just the way it's designed, but it falls off pretty easily. It's pretty cool though. I like it. It'll look good next to the panda. I'm sure it'll be in some future videos. But my only gripe with this video is the instructions. They're not clear at all. They're really hard to understand. It took me a long time to understand them. But that's okay. I mean, again, I only paid 100 yen for a dollar. So not too bad, but yeah, it's not that great of a quality, but you know, it's fun little build and I like building stuff, so it's pretty cool. And this time we have a lot of extra pieces. I don't think they really pay attention, but whatever. All right. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.